Hey, what's up everybody? Freddy C here, and welcome back to Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. Now, originally we were going to go to Kiwani Province to finish off the last of the Santa Blanca smuggling operations before going after El Bukita and Nidia Flores. But today I'm going to give you guys a special gameplay. Welcome to... Operation Silent Spade! Now, Scott Mitchell, codenamed Griffin, leader of the Ghost Unit, is currently in Bolivia to run a critical operation. We gotta get into contact with him as soon as possible. Well, then that's exactly what we're gonna do. I kinda wanted to get this special operation done and over with, so we're gonna unlock something when we complete the mission. I'll drive. Or should I say Lieutenant Colonel Scott Mitchell? Now if you remember Mitchell from him, back when he was a captain. But now, he's, he's risen through the ranks pretty good. And, he is now a lieutenant colonel in this game. And I think he's got a special mission for all of us. But we're gonna find out as soon as we get to him. <laughs> Approaching the boss in a mini truck, or, or a mini bus. Ah, there he is, the boss man himself. What's up, Colonel Mitchell? Nomad. Long time no see, boss. Hope Bolivia is treating you well. He's kept us busy. As long as you're on the clock, we have a new situation I was hoping you could help with. Shoot. Turns out there's more to Bolivia than weapons-grade cocaine. They've discovered uranium lurking under all those plants. And they've started mining it. Shit. It gets worse. We have intel that says Russian ultra-nationalists are helping them in exchange for getting their hands on some of it. That's solid? We have a ghost on the ground there. A sharp new kid who's infiltrated Unidad posing as a Russian agent. Codename Little Brother. Cute. Unidad is sending samples of this uranium to Russia soon, and we need to intercept it. Get in touch with Little Brother, and he'll walk you through the op. Copy that. Oh, that doesn't sound good. So hold up. It's not just coke that they're doing, or mining. It's also weapons-grade uranium? And, and ultra-nationalists are helping? Oh, this is bad. This is really bad. I'm in, let's roll. Well, God damn, Mitchell came down to play in Bolivia. <laughs> I hope he didn't get rusty behind that desk. Never happened. Eh. Once he's back on a two-way shooting range, it'll come back to him. We're getting the band back together. Seems like uh, Colonel Mitchell's got a lot of respect for these guys. Dude's a true soldier. God, I miss playing as him. You know, to be truthful and honest, I really wish that uh, all the previous Ghost Recon games would be remastered for PlayStations 4 and 5. 4 is... Four zero is coming to an end, which is sad. Oh Christ, please don't call me that. Can it be something just a little bit cooler? Spade. I like Spade. I'm not compromising operational integrity to give you a new code name. You don't like it, take it up with Griffin. Shit. Sure thing. Old timer. We keep a tight schedule. What's the sit rep? They got this place sealed up tight. Only way in is by Halo. You're gonna have to base jump in here from the cliff overhead. What kind of welcome can we expect? I'll clear our landing zone for you. That's the best you're gonna get. Come in frosty and don't bother knocking off your boots. Halo jump, huh? You mean like this? A base jump. Right. Walk or run to the edge of a cliff and hit the X. Yeah, I already know how to do that. Remember to stay undetected. If anyone sees you, the mission's over. No problem. You really think we can trust this punk? Griffin vouched for him. Griffin's not parachuting hot into a Unidad base. Sometimes you gotta have a little faith. And God, though, right? And Griffin. We're in. Keep your heads down. It can't be detected. I 
ask the rebels to do a recon of the area. We copy. We lay in enemy positions now. Might as well silence my F2000. And MPX. And the 5.7, which I used in the previous gameplay. Now keep in mind, this is a special type of gameplay, so it's not going to be part of the story mode. This is for a special playlist that I have for you guys, but more on that later. Oh, here's our guy right here. Glad you all finally made it. We do the job right. Yeah, meanwhile, Unidad loaded the shipment on a helicopter and is just waiting for the word to haul it out of here. Why didn't you just grab the bird and go? Yeah, it's not that simple. They're taking security seriously. They lock down the controls, and the only one who has the code is the chopper's pilot. So we grab him and get the code. Why are we here again? Seems like our little hotshot could have handled this on his own. The code changes every day. How was I supposed to know when new relics were gonna show up? If you'd gotten the code, you could have flown out of here at any point, right? Well, not everyone knows how to fly one of those things. Shit! Well... Rally up, people. Let's not... Copy that. Let's not argue. What the? Whoa, what the hell is that? It's an optical camo suit. Reactive camouflage? Since when? This is just a prototype from Skeltech. They asked me to do some field tests. Sign me up for one of those. Maybe one day. Ready to engage. All right, we got to take some of these guys out. Stealthily. There's right, drone. Three. Eyes on two Unidad soldiers. Next to the container, see? There's drone jammers in the area, so I won't be able to use the drone. Unless I can find the generator and disable it. Or the jammer itself. Head on a swivel, shithead. You got one close. I'm moving to position. I need to get to a better position. Easy with that, man. Come on. Target acquired. Stodger that. Target marked. Tango down. There's the drone jammer. We're good. We're good. I need you there. Roger that. Uh, we should have plenty of time. What about the SAM launchers? They'll blast us out of the sky. We should shut down the generators. Yeah, let's shut that down. Bad guys inbound. Okay, jammer's down. Drone is airborne. Now I can get the drone. He makes five. I asked the rebels to recon the area for us. God, these sand launches are a pain in the ass. Telling me. Got it. Moving. Let me get a good sight line. Copy. Target marked. Target marked. Kill confirmed. Crap. I got another. That's five. Danger close, danger close. Go. Roger. Scale technology. Oh yeah, that's in the that's in the sequel game after this. Let me just ID some targets real quick before we find the pilot. Sniper Shouldn't take long. Target spotted. Who's over here? I asked the rebels to do a recon of the area. There you are. Now we just gotta get to you without being detected. Sniper, top of the tower. Sniper up in the tower. Target's marked. 
Good that to must go. be the chopper we need to take. That's 15. Just spotted one with submachine guns. Okay. I got eyes on an HVT. Move there. Copy. Oh boy. Tangos are marked. What's the word? Take him out. Relax, we're still good. Go. We'll go. Yeah, this requires a lot of stealth. I'm getting a position. Bad guys are marked. Waiting on you, boss. Target set. Got ready it. to assault. Move there. Bad guys inbound. Let's go around. Target's confirmed. Ready to assault. There you are. It's better to do that. We're here for the chopper. Give me the code. Что это? Это пиздец. Let's hope you learn some English. Or you're gonna die wishing you had. Yes, of course. I speak English. I'll tell you the code. You know, I speak Russian. I could have interrogated him. You didn't have to be so rough with him. We got what we needed. You worry about getting us that chopper. Let me mark his location for you. I'm getting it marked. Just say the word. Wait a minute. That looks familiar. Wait a second. I've seen that before. That's a symbol of the Raven's Rock Regina. From Ghost Recon Future Soldier. I should have known they were an ultranationalist group. Let me find a good position. Shit, I gotta find a good position. Crap. You guys realize the second we're airborne, shit's gonna hit the fan. But we're carrying their uranium. They wouldn't shoot us down, right? Anyone wanna take odds on that bet? I didn't think so. That'd be insane. Insane would be letting us go. They'd rather get rid of the evidence than risk what we're carrying. That's facts. Alright, uh... If I'm gonna get that, uh... If I'm gonna get that chopper to a rally point, then, uh, I'm gonna have to move a little fast. I need to get to a I got position. It. Moving to position. Target marked. Roger. Ready. Target acquired. Hold the shot. Danger close. Danger close. Phew. Clear on my side. All right, we're good. Let's take the chopper. Ooh, nice camouflage. And... The whole region is crawling with AA. They'll knock you out of the sky. The only way to get past it is to keep low and fly through that canyon. Think you can manage that? Aye! We're Only completely to vulnerable to their anti-aircraft. <sighs> Great, I damaged it. Not what I wanted to do. Unidentified aircraft. You are not cleared for this sector. Identify yourself immediately. 
Shit, they're all over us. Is it too early for I told you so? We need to tell them something. Like what? Tell them we're pizza delivery. This ain't Hollywood shithead. Unidentified aircraft. Respond. Well, that's bad. Great, had you I know, not... No, I told Griffin I could figure out how to fly this thing. Qualify for planes. But not choppers. How hard can it be? Griffin made the right call. Okay, if I get hit by a rocket or something, I'm going to have to do this in a second take, and I don't want to do that. Unidentified aircraft. Respond or we will fire. This is your final warning. Yeah, why is it being so difficult to fly? Crap! They must have called out half of Unidad to stop us. Just another day on the job, kid. Hold on tight. This is gonna get messed no. up. This helicopter is proof of what the Russians are up to. We can't let them destroy it. Plus, we don't want to radiate half of Bolivia. We're ourselves. Let's take these choppers out. If they get a lock on us, we're finished. We're pretty much toast anyway. Let them get a lock on us. Oh. Let's get away from there. Great. All right. We got to try again. That means we got to do the stealth thing all over again. Had I not damaged the damn thing in the first place, I probably would have gotten it done in one shot. Oh, I hate that. Well, something must be really wrong with the joystick around here. I mean, this is like my second controller. Yeah, I don't even want to think about it right now. Okay, I may have to split this mission into a two-parter because, uh, I don't know. I really thought I was going to nail this one in one shot, but that's not the case. Steal the helicopter without being detected. Okay. Well, stealing the chopper is one thing. I asked the rebels to recon the area for us. Moving to position. Find a good position. Okay. Moving Let's to a better try position. this again. Eyes on the target. Target acquired. Ready to fire. Going on. Tango knows somebody's got a bead on him. We're cool. We're cool. Sniper, top of the tower. Well, that got him. Rally on me. Moving. Well, at least we don't have to go after the pilot again. But something tells me we should shut down the SAM sites. The rebels to do a recon of the area. I need to get to a better position. Yo, grunt with the submachine gun. Got the target. Check the helipad. Roger. Engaging tangos. I got eyes on near the helipad. See? I need you there. Roger that. Alright, hang on. I shut down the generator, I shut down the SAM site and the drone, uh, 
drone jammer or something. I think. Tangos are marked. I think the drone jammer's down. Yeah, it stopped moving. Rally up, people. Copy. I'm getting up to get into position. I got a target carrying submachine guns. Target acquired. Eyes on the target. Line. Taking a shot. Guys realize the second we're airborne, it's just gonna hit the fan. Ah, oh, come on! Here. That was not supposed to happen. All right, take three. Jesus Christ. This was supposed to be a one-shot thing. But no, as of right now, it's taking more than one shot. Now we got to do this again. You know, I'm definitely splitting this into a two-parter. All right, hang on. I asked the rebels to recon the area for us. I'm moving to position. Let me find a good position. Shit, I gotta find a good position. Target acquired. Hit the dirt, helicopter. Ready, call the shot. I'm shooting these fuckers. Tango, okay, we're still all right. My apologies for the multiple attempts. Sniper up in the tower. Rally on me. A copy. Moving. Target number five. Moving Tangles to position. Marked. Standing by. I need a better position. Got the target. Target acquired. Standing by. Target down. We're good. We're good. I asked the rebels to do a recon of the area. Where you got him? Drone is up. Roger that. Spotted one with Let me get a good sight. I got it. Moving to position. Roger that. Target, Target marked. marked. Say the word. He's dead. You guys realize the second we're airborne, shit's gonna hit the fan. But we're carrying their uranium. They wouldn't shoot us down, right? Anyone wanna take odds on that bet? I didn't think so. That'd be insane. Insane would be letting us go. They'd rather get rid of the evidence than risk what we're carrying. All right, let's not crash this thing this time. I'll pilot. Wait, where is he? Forget it. 
knocked you out of the sky. The only way to get past it is to keep... Only one way to find out. God, this thing is slow. Alright, let's try this one again. something. Like what? Tell them we're pizza delivery. This ain't Hollywood shithead. Unidentified aircraft. Respond. Great. There had to be sirens in the background. You know, I told Griffin I could figure out how to fly this thing. Qualify for planes. But not choppers. How hard can it be? Griffin made the right call. Unidentified aircraft. Respond or we will fire. This is your final warning. Let's get you. Here we go. They must have called out half of you to dad to stop us. Just another damn job, kid. Hold on tight. This is gonna get messy. The helicopter is proof of what the Russians are up to. We can't let them destroy it. Plus, we don't want to radiate half of the Got it. We're now for the little birds. We'll take his choppers out. He loves destroy it. Or little birds. Well, one actually. What the? You have got to be joking. That's an attack, Hilo. Saved by the bell. Oh, thank God. I thought we were doomed at least six times there. I counted seven. Good work. Let's check in. The sooner we get away from this radioactive shit, the better. Hey, there's Colonel Mitchell. <sighs> thank God. Good work, ghosts. At least we got you away from your desk. With the mosquitoes down here, I'm about to go back. Better the mosquitoes than the office politics. <laughs> you might have something there. I need to make a call to the decontamination unit to check on the shipment. Why don't you and your team wait for me inside? All right, we're going to enter the rally point. Alright, so like I said, I'm going to have to split this gameplay into two parts because it took me like three attempts to get this mission done. And that took way too damn long and I'm not going to have enough time to have part two mixed into one video. So after this, I'll just stop, take a break, and I'll be right back for a part two of Operation Silent Spade. But first, let's enter the rally point and figure out who we're dealing with. People know El Comandante was a culero, but they know he was a patriot too. Some pendejo in Acevedo already wrote the corrido about him. It's really awful. Come on, Karen. Okay, we're still good. Alright. Let's see what we got. Eh. I trust babysitting little brother here didn't give you too much trouble. Oh, can we drop that? For anything else? Nomad? Let me introduce you to John Kozak, one of the sharpest of our young recruits. Kozak. Oh, you heard of me? Yeah, just what? a bit of chatter on the grapevine. 
All of it good. I'm glad you had your team in place here, Nomad. If the Russians suspect the U.S. of getting involved here, it could make things tense back in Washington. From what I heard of you, Dad, there's a power struggle going on inside the Russian government. They don't know what faction they're working with. They just Hold care on. about the color that. Uh huh. How much? Shit. We have a situation. What's the snafu? Part of the package you just delivered is missing. What? How much? Enough that we can't just round it off. We need to lay hands on it. Immediately. I hate to say this, sir, but if time's an issue, we should bring Bowman in on this. Make it happen. Yeah, might as well. Bowman, got a situation here. We intercepted a shipment of uranium headed to Russia, but a good chunk of it's gone missing. I need to know what you know about this. Wait, this is the first I've heard of this. Are we dating other people now? It's an internal gosop. Family first, I get it. I did hear some scuttlebutt about a shipment Santa Blanc is transferring in a freight train station in Inca Camina. That might be your tango. Thanks. I owe you one. No, I owe you one less. Kozak, head back to that Unidad base and see if you can figure out where that shipment went. Nomad, take your crew to Inca Camina and follow up on that lead. Goodbye me. Let's see which one of us drags gold first. Hey, this isn't a game. Stay on your toes and try not to screw up. <laughs> I'll see you at the finish line. <laughs> Yeah, I keep telling myself I was just as cocky at that age. I don't believe that for a second. He's the best tech I've ever seen. A real wizard. We almost lost him to Skeletech, but lucky enough for us, he wanted to work in the field. One of the youngest ghosts ever. We usually have a little more seasoning. I don't want to question your judgment, sir. I do enough of that for the both of us. That kid there might be as green as a coca leaf, but mark my words, when it comes to soldiers like us, He's the future. If he lives long enough to see it. So, that operative was John Kozak. Anybody remember him from Ghost Recon Future Soldier? Yeah, you play as him. Interesting. <clears throat> oh, look, we got a parachute. <laughs> All right, so that's the first part of Operation Silent Spade. Something tells me I may need to... Ooh, you look like you could use a paint job there, buddy boy. Let me fix you up. Good as new. Check on the MPX. Yep, you need a paint job too. You as well. You know what? I think I'll use the same loadout for the second part. Um... You get this just for completing the mission. <laughs> Impressive. All right, so since this is a two-parter because of the many attempts I had to do in order to get the mission to be complete, I'm going to have to fast travel to Inca Camina Alpha, and I'm going to have to stop part one right here and take a quick little break. And then come back in a couple of minutes and finish the rest of Operation Silent Spade in a second part. Once I'm all done with that, then I can start working on a video gameplay for Operation Oracle. I'm pretty sure you guys might like that one. There, we get to team up with yet another ghost, and I think you guys know who it is. If you played this game before and did Operation Oracle, you know who we're going to be teaming up with. I don't want to spoil it. Or do you already know? <laughs> get out, to the end. Oh, man, I don't, I don't know. But anyways, let me just highlight this real quick. And I'm going to end part one for now. But I'm going to take a quick little break, and I'm going to be right back, guys. So I'm signing off for now, but don't worry. I'm going to be right back after these messages. So stand by, guys. I'll be right back. <laughs> 